one hour after people. Above ground, Seattle's International Airport is quiet. But 20 feet underground, the, train is arriving. the arrivals and departures continue. Driven by computer, these people movers were designed to operate with no human involvement. Radio signals beamed from the master control room ensure the trains don't collide. Trains would glide into a station, doors would open, the doors would close, the train would move on to the next stop. It's ominous and it's ironic. The only thing moving at an airport is a train. One month after people. In the tunnels below Seattle's International Airport, a transportation system designed specifically to work without the presence of man has broken down. The last of the emergency lights loses its power. The last battery gives out, and the semi-darkened, ominous passenger corridors become totally dark. The driverless trains sit powerless, except for one thing, emergency battery backups, which keep the public address system working. Board here for South Main Terminal, S, A, and B gates. Trains to oblivion, serving no one in a life after people. Good. 